Hi, I'm Carrie. And I'm Dave. This is EW's TV Recaps for March 21st. It was elimination night for our top 10 on American Idol last night. Mm. Ladies and gentlemen, we got to force him out for MK Novelet, who failed to get the judges save and went home. I'm really going to miss MK. While I think she's an amazing singer, she has a really subtle stage presence, which I don't think American Idol is ultimately looking for. Sure. But it seemed like the judges were really struggling with their decision. They were talking throughout her entire performance, and I'm willing to bet Harry was the one who didn't want to save her. Well, don't feel too bad for her. Mm. She is still the first openly gay contestant on American American Idol Yay. ever. And hey, maybe one day MK can sing back up on a Jennifer Lopez performance. Like season 8's Allison Iraheta, season 10's Pia Toscano, and season 11's Jessica Sanchez did tonight. <laughs> there you have it, three of Idol's most talented ladies ever singing Aloya Poppy. That song has been burned into my head and ingrained into <laughs> oh my, my God, soul. I kind of think I hate you, Poppy. Uh, please pat your weave when you say that. Elsewhere last night, we learned that Harry Connick Jr. can't <laughs> rap, which shouldn't be a surprise to anyone. For everything you need, you know you got to pay. <laughs> okay, do you really think that J-Lo first heard herself on the radio while riding in a stinky New York City cab? Yeah. She was already a movie star by then, right? Yes. Just made my first album, we turned it in, and I was in a cab, and all of a sudden it came on. And we were all like, oh my God! Yeah, I mean, thinks J-Lo was rewriting history there. If by cab you mean limo, then yeah, sure. <laughs> then again, I guess the truth wouldn't really make a great story. Yeah. Uh, I first heard my uh, first song on the radio when a record producer played it for me on the way to an award show. And I was like, who's that? And they were like, you, remember? You have a record album. And I was like, oh yeah, I should date Diddy now. Do you guys think the judges should have saved MK? Sound off in the comments and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And follow us on Twitter.